Yow, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to another edition of X Television. I am your host, X9. We've got some Highlander action for you today. This is from the Asian division of UGC and is the third place match. Also was a best of three. So we have a couple maps headed our way. Uh, let's uh, try to run down lineups real quick in the next 20 seconds. Oh my God, go quick. We have Daddy's uh, House versus Alliance Supreme. Daddy's on blue. Uh, Ellie is the, the Medic uh, Arcadia, the Demo Man, Bad Aimer, uh, Scout, Barry on Pyro, Simi, the Spy, Andrew on Engineer, uh, Arius is uh, what I heard the soldier was, but I'll also go with Arse and Moonburn, uh, the Sniper, Chrissy is the Heavy Weapons guy. So, well, that was about half of them. Uh, you can see the other half on the uh, scoreboard, though, and uh, we'll try to break them down as soon as we can. So, uh, kind of a backward uh, hold here from the red team to start things off on Badwater. Beginning of this stopwatch. See the, the spy finally starting to go for uh, some action. Uh, gets behind here. Goes for the soldier. Nice stab. That's going to slow things down a little bit here. The Uber is up, up top. Uh, let's see what uh, they can get accomplished here. They really are just going to need to uh, make sure to take out that sentry gun. Uh, but we can see the engineer still pretty well established. Sentry gun still up as well. So, um, you know, this offensive push though, since they're continuing to push through the cart, uh, the cart through the tunnel, and they got, uh, you know, at least a few opening uh, frags. They got Ubers popped on both sides. So they're not at a disadvantage there. Uh, that's going to work out for them. They'll be able to just kind of work this up top now again with the demo man, and uh, we'll see if they can get uh, the uh, frags they need to open things up. Um, Red Engineer, though, still doing pretty solid up top here with his gun. Um, still up, still not having any problems, and uh, the cart just really starting to get out of uh, the tunnel. Nice uh, stickies from Vin Vin, uh, throwing some good uh, defensive uh, damage out in order to kind of just push the other team backwards. Let's check uh, Blue Sniper here. In that snipe war uh, against his opponent, he's doing all right. Certainly need to open things up there to uh, uh, really kind of uh, get the advantage here on Badwater if we can kill that other sniper. This is looking like a great Uber right now. Uh, sentry gun still up though. Danny doing a great job using that rescue ranger now while staying on his dispenser. That gun then wrangling it to get that range across. And that gun is still up, so uh, doing a little bit of a Sigafu impres impersonation right there. The spy's gonna come in here. And what are you gonna do, Danny? Oh, uh, you're gonna get a headshot. What, that's what's going to happen. I was confused if he was uh, just standing there uh, on the teleporter exit uh, or something. I don't, I don't know. But he just got taken out. Uh, it was a little bit weird. I guess maybe he was using that uh, um, blank on the name of the weapon right now. Uh, but using that wrench to go back uh, to uh, base, maybe just that teleport hadn't finished up yet. Uh, I don't know. The animation is a little weird there. So he's going to have to try to get set up here. Uh, right now, though, Daddy's house, oof, steamrolling through that second point. So... Um, you know, even though that they got held pretty significantly on that first point, able to just keep the charge uh, going and uh, keep that cart rolling. So uh, that's going to be beneficial for them uh, without a doubt. That second point can uh, get really locked down and can be uh, very challenging if uh, the defense, you know, gets mounted. So Arcadia trying to throw a couple rollers over the top, get that slide down. See if uh, Cal can get a sniper to open things up. That sniper maybe almost getting uh, unintentionally shot as uh, he was just standing right in the way of things. Here we see uh, the um, Alliance Supreme's soldier just jumping around, being obnoxious with that black box. Certainly doing work with so many large health packs back here. You can just keep jumping around and uh, finding one wherever. He's, he's way, way far back, though, not really having much of an impact on the fight. Checking out some of the other players. We do have uh, Medic Heavy pretty far up here for Blue. Um, Card has gotten closer, but they're still having to deal with some obnoxiousness behind them. That float up is going to put a stop to that soldier, though. Uh, his uh, his time of being a harassing distraction is over for now. And the team's just going to have to kind of back up here and uh, chill out for a second. They almost have uh, Uber Charge, the attacking team. Uh, that is Daddy's house once again. So uh, looking to get started here. Let's see if we can uh, 
pull up that uh, sniper, see if he can get uh, an opening shot here. Try to open up uh, the play here a little bit and uh, create an end for his team. But uh, looks like they're just going to be able to get an Uber in here. The uh, demo man also uh, getting good work, taking out the, the sentry gun up top. And uh, that cap almost complete. Just a few more stickies. That demo man doing a good job staying alive, but oh no, everybody else is going down around him. Having a lot of difficulty here. He's just got to back up. Yeah, his next uh, combat class is all the way back at this spawn. So a good defense uh, standing strong here for... Um, uh, Alliance Supreme. See the uh, sentries going back up. Heavy's up here. And uh, they have an Uber charge ready to go as well. So, I mean, they're, they're feeling pretty comfortable. Medics just work in the corner, which is uh, pretty much the spot to be. That was the spy getting found out there. So, uh, that's a little bit comforting for Daddy's house. You know, you don't have that spy lurking around. It definitely kind of frees things up quite a bit. Uh, the snipe's not really making anything happen, but we do have, uh, must have been uh, some sort of mini crit got activated there. Oh, good Uber on the cart by uh, the uh, Alliance Supreme, I keep forgetting their name, uh, to uh, get on the cart and get a block going there. The capture finally does come down. A better defense on that third point. The second point, they really didn't have much of a time to put together a defense uh, as they uh, just got uh, you know pushed they, they held on to that first point for so long, and then they just got pushed uh, over uh, rather quickly. So uh, right now, though, uh, Daddy's House doing a good job of keeping that cart rolling. I glanced down for a second, it was times one, but now they have that times three, which is oh so crucial. And uh, their demo man, Arcadia, as well, has just been staying far forward here, able to just really get involved in uh, getting some early damage on these classes and pushing red into kind of weird positions. See if Danny can get much of a sentry gun up here. He does have the Jag, um, but just a level one out right now. Uh, Arcadia, this the demo man here, Zwit. I almost want to call him, but I guess Arcadia is his real name, not just what he's tagged up in game. How how am I supposed to know? Man. Uh, sorry, first world caster problems. Uh, Blue getting a really good Uber push in here, though. Uh, and again, um, Alliance Supreme haven't really had much of a chance to set up a defense. Uh, they, I think they just maybe had a level two, but that gun got uh, dealt with pretty swiftly. And uh, the, the frags are continuing to come here, so this is a, a pretty good offensive push here. The uh, demo man not running the pain train, which uh, can be a helpful choice on uh, Highlander. Shouldn't really be pushing the cart much as a demo man, but you never know when it's going to come up. So 708, that's a pretty great time to start things off here for Daddy's House. Uh, we'll see what sort of defensive structure they take here on this point and uh, if they approach things in a different matter. Um, certainly good initial defense uh, by Alliance Supreme, but, uh, you know, as I was saying, they held on for so long, their, their engineer couldn't get a, a defense set up on second. And just the way that the frags worked and stuff, it, it wasn't a possibility for them to uh, keep the train rolling. See several suicides here. Uh, people were asking in the comments about this. Uh, the time before, but uh, these weapons thrown on the ground uh, in order to give the engineer uh, extra metal. One of the other players also doing a good job of uh, not taking them. That scout just uh, suicided a little bit late here too, um, but uh, I think that uh, that should still work out with that uh, teleporter going up in time. So uh, it'll be interesting to see here what we can get offensively from Alliance Supreme and uh, how they can counter things. Looking at the scoreboard real quick. Looks like things uh, pretty well spread out for da uh, Daddy's house, while Lance Supreme uh, perhaps having a little bit more of a tough time uh, getting some of those frags out. Uh, obviously, though, I think offensive, there's a little bit more uh, opportunity to score the points here. Uh, we'll see how they do this time around. They're running the uh, Crits Creek here, but you can see they're just taking their time to get out here and get developed. Maybe a bit early of a Crits as, uh, yeah, they're just like way too far back right now. And it uh, looks like Billy Joe gets uh, sniped as well. I'm going to be mispronouncing that name, I bet you, because I, I just want to call him Billy Joel, the uptown girl. Instead, it is Billy Joe. Maybe that's more of a... Is that, is that the guy from Green Day? I don't, I don't know. Anyways, uh, Uber comes down to, to counter the uh, cart here. Um, 
It's good obstructionism, but I don't think it was necessary. Uh, now they've kind of ditched this uh, sentry gun setup a little bit. We'll see if uh, Alliance Supreme can uh, get some some damage on that and get that uh, taken care of. Right now, their uh, heavy is trying to walk up here. He's taking a decent amount of damage, though. Yeah, down to 80 health. It's going to take him a while to get uh, healed up. He's calling for it. Yeah, should just eat that sandwich. That is what he's going to do. And uh, he's feeling pretty healthy, ready to go again. Um, Alliance uh, Supreme have switched over to the medic gun, so they didn't stay on that crit streak. Sometimes at the beginning of a uh, Highlander match, um, if you're uh, crits versus uber, uh, you can start with uh, the crits and then you just follow it up and you stick on that crits because you can get them to uh, force that pop pretty early and just stay with it and that gives you a pretty good tempo for attacking. Kind of slows you down with that initial push, but uh, you know, yeah, you're just able to follow it up really well. So, uh, oh my god, oh wow, barely stopped. Pat almost got that sneak cap in. Um, that would have been uh, excellent. You know, that pushes back the spawns uh, quite a bit and uh, makes things easier to deal with. It uh, looks like PP now, uh, instead of running that black box, is now back onto the regular rockets. Tries to just bomb his way in and finish off that cap, but uh, not able to do that. As we can see from uh, Vin Vin's perspective too, that uh, sentry gun was still up. It now gets uh, teleported backwards though, so uh, that's... Uh, uh, gonna be helpful. Oh, it looks like teleported downhill, so not that far away. A little bit closer to the uh, sentry gun, as you can see. Um, also see PP uh, switching between a lot of different weapons there. Um, this lower ground uh, is pretty good. I almost thought, though, they were just gonna ditch this point and get back to the second point, uh, as that kind of was the problem with Daddy's house last round. You see here, uber heavy. Uh, I'm, I'm sure that that uh, engineer was throwing a lot at trying to keep that gun up, but just couldn't quite... Oh, man! And the uh, heavy comes under uh, a lot of fire, not able to uh, survive any longer. Got that sentry gun, but that cart uh, is getting, well, well, it rolled backwards a little bit. Pat on it now. They've got to make sure to stop this, though, indeed. And uh, Pat kind of gets thrown up in the air, tries to get the medic uh, after that card capture uh, got blocked. Oh, man. Daddy's moonbeam uh, with the snipe there. A lot of action going on all over the place, but Daddy's house definitely... Um, showing off their skill set here uh, on uh, the uh, uh, payload map uh, doing great stuff here we'll have Asheville as our second map and Viaduct as the third map if needed so uh, you know only one payload payload definitely kind of one of the classics uh, for Highlander in terms of game modes um, but looks like we will be uh, switching it up uh, for the other maps involved here Cal gets taken off uh, taken out and again this defense very huge here uh, three minutes on the uh, stopwatch overall but if they just hold it for another 30 seconds here uh, that's going to be it uh, they don't have to go the full distance um, already definitely you know setting up a great defense here and um, alliance supreme will have to just kind of man up and keep rolling all the way through if they uh, want to be able to beat this time but uh, looking increasingly uh, unlikely, that cart rolling backwards in effect now. And uh, Vin Vin has to back up. Billy Joel is down. And uh, Widowmaker, I love to see it. Uh, Danny trying to get some frags out here. And uh, that's going to do it. Wow. Uh, what a stiff defense by Daddy's house. Uh, they, they got a great time. And uh, then we're just able to uh, hold it on the first point. Took a while to get that sentry gun down. And then kind of a little bit of indecisiveness in between, you know, do we, are we going to run crits on this? Are we going to run medic gun? Uh, what's the strategy to, to help us unlock the victory here? We actually only need the one set here, so that's actually going to do it. Uh, in this best of three format with the maps, they only play one set of uh, a payload map here. So uh, just like that, Daddy's House with a very stiff defense, take the map. That's going to take us to Koth Asheville, our second map. Hope you enjoyed uh, this map. This bad water it was uh, pretty quick, but uh, you know some uh, some good good skills on display. Let's uh, see what these teams got in store for us on Asheville. I will see you guys over there. I'm next time. See you next time. Peace out.